Hi, I'm Debbie, founder of DB Wellbeing. Today I'm going to show you some exercises for thoracic mobility. The thoracic spine is what we refer to as our middle back. Okay, this is our cervical, this is our lumbar, and this is our thoracic. A lot of times we do work for the upper and the lower, but we forget to get some mobility into that thoracic spine. And the thoracic spine, due to gravity, daily activities, a lot of different things, tends to lock up. So first what we're gonna do is put our feet shoulder width apart, and we're going to roll our shoulders back and down and cross our arms at mid chest level, right above the belly button around the sternum. We're going to rotate from side to side and our head is going to go with our arms because the body goes where the head goes. If I keep my head looking at you straight and I try to turn, I don't get as much rotation as if I turn the, body, the head with the body, okay? Try from the other side. If I stay staring at you, I only move to this degree. But if I move my head with my body, I can almost go a lot farther. I can almost go all the way around. <laughs> so we're gonna just rotate back and forth, getting some thoracic mobility. We're gonna try to keep those hips sturdy and we're not gonna sway moving our hips. My hips are strong, my feet are planted, and we're just rotating from the waist up. Next, I'm gonna take a ball. It doesn't have to be a balance ball. It can be smaller. This is what I have here. And we're going to simply raise our arms up and down. This is an exercise that warms up the lats, the largest muscle in the back, and gets some heat moving through there and mobility. And you can do this maybe 10 times, three different times. Good. I can also angle to the side. I can go up, rotating and turning my heel, back down to the middle, up, rotating my heel. In addition to these, I wanna make sure that my movements with my thoracic spine are supported by keeping my core nice and tight throughout all the exercises that we do.